Let's go do all the stuff. So now we need to make sure the pH of this is exactly seven. So let's ask the spoon. Hey, what's the pH, spoon? Report. The mixture has a pH balance of zero. Good thing I'm acid proof. An acid proof spoon. Oh, and I'll just put that back in my pocket. No worries that it'll Don't burn through Don't wipe it off or yeah. anything. Don't worry, it won't burn through my trousers. So we want to We want to make it less acidic, so we put this in there. What are those, eggshells? Shells is shells, right? Actually, calcium carbonate is the main ingredient in all kinds of shells. Exactly. So you were listening to my night lectures on science. Uh-huh. Sure, Dad. Yeah, whatever. Like, all right, well... Not really, but okay. How's the pH balance in there? The mixture has a pH balance of three. Exactly. Just a little more. So we're going to have to do the eggshell two more times, and then we use the fruit. Because the eggshell makes it go up three, and the fruit makes it go down two. And then... Hang on there, son. Do you know how acidic that fruit is? No, but my spoon will tell me. I will. With pleasure, sir. <laughs> mm, worth a shot. Okay, Spoon. This should be correct now. Any luck? I'm detecting a pH level of... 7! Eureka! Ta-da! Balance, sir! <laughs> nice work, son. <laughs> now for the final ingredient. Just a small bonding and reduction agent. <gasps> it's... perfection. So small. A little goes a long way. Come on, <laughs> let's go fix that ship. Do you remember when I they were like, science. "Oh, he came up with the whipped cream recipe while making the bonding agent"? Mm. Oh God, amazing! Yeah. Just like my dad used to make. Let me at that hull, and I'll start patching her up. Sure, go, go ahead. Hey, can I go down there? Uh, aren't you busy helping me find stuff for my ship? Oh yeah, what's left? Still need an electronics genius, and uh, gotta replace my heavy duty anti gravity thrust unit. Once we take care of that, we'll be ready to fly. On it. Alright, I know how to do those other two, so. We gotta go. I wanna go take care of that stupid Harmony. Like, White beard guy. Yes. So we need to go up there and see what kind of the knot we have because she just gave us the knot for something that I don't even remember asking for. So we'll just figure it out, I guess. Further. Further. Could you try to describe that knot to me? Uh, uh, let's give that knot another. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Tug on the piggy's tail. Tug on the piggy's tail. Okay. Uh-oh. That made it worse. Uh, what does it look like now? Well, uh... Like a whole new terrible knot. So now we know what it looks like, so we can just go... Yeah. And ask for a new diagram. We'll be like, hey, I followed your instructions, but I'm an idiot. You're She's gonna be like, okay, well, you have to just follow. Because if you get the instructions wrong, you have to go all the way back again. But it's okay because it'll cut you straight to that area rather than um, making you go back and forth like this. Like what we're doing right now. Mm -hmm. Hey, Carol. Oh. <laughs> uh, I need another knot untying diagram. Oh, yeah? Um. Like a headache wearing a belt? That seems like it. Yeah. Like a headache wearing a belt. Hmm. I think I know that one. <laughs> Here's a diagram. Follow those instructions exactly. Or you'll have a totally different knot on your hands. Thanks. Now, are we allowed to look at it and see if we got it right? Well, no, because... Okay, so what he'll say is... Oh, I think that makes it better. Uh, and then you'll know that you're doing it right. And then if you get it wrong, 
He'll say, oh, this looks worse, and then he'll tell you what it looks like and you have to start all over again. Let's jump on here. And so we have to, like, figure out... <laughs> this must be terrible for people who have recognition problems, but whatever. Yeah. I have a diagram here that will show you how to untie it. Let's give that knot another try, okay? Okay. Alright, so we have to... Um, she loves me, she loves me not. I... this is... what? Unraveled... let's do a she loves me, she loves me not. Because that sure. seems the closest. She loves me, she loves me not. I'll give it a shot. Rats. That was a bad idea. Shit! Oh, uh, what does it look like now? Well, uh... Like a whole new... Terrible knot. Let's just try and get a knot that's easy to describe. Yeah. Oh, brother. Let's take a break and try again later. Yeah. Let's give that knot. Just tuck. Further, could you try to describe that knot to me? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. So you it's stay got here. some knots at the top and then a bunch of loops on the bottom. Hey, Carol. Oh, that's so nice to hear. Uh, I need another nut. Okay. Uh, I think it's a face that's really a cow's udder, right? Because it's got yeah. the loops on the bottom. Okay. Yeah. A face that's <laughs> really a cow's udder. Okay, let's go. Sure. All of these are like so interpretive though. It's like, how? Well, when I first did it, I was like, oh, that's easy. And then I got it right away. But a lot of these other ones are really like, uh, I don't know. Like what if somebody has a problem with, you know, recognizing things? I feel like I always interpret these types of things incorrectly. This was a problem that I always had on school tests where I would like read a math problem mm -hmm. and like you know where they give you like a Oh it's a worded math problem. It's a worded math problem and I would always interpret it incorrectly because I'd be like oh they're saying this and they were like no they're not they're saying that and I'd be like that doesn't make any sense why would anybody say that? You know what I mean? You know what? That shouldn't even be a... a I, like, I understand why that would be a question, but I really don't think it should be a question because when you're applying math to real life, you're smart enough to apply it to real life. You don't need to translate it from real life because when you're translating it from your own life, you're using your own... Description? Your own description. Yeah. So that's like kind of just setting up kids for failure, in my opinion. Let's give that not another try, okay? Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, did we start out incorrectly? I don't know. Mm, pull it, apart the snakes? Uh, pull yeah. apart the fighting snakes. I think I see what you mean. Now it's even Damn it. Ah! Uh, What does it look like now? Well, uh, like a whole new terrible knot. Hang on. I'm gonna get a new diagram and be right back. Okay. What's it look like this time? A little bit like you, strangely enough. That's true! A little bit like... you, strangely enough. Hmm. I think I know that one. Okay, we have Here's to get right this time. Follow those instructions exactly. Oh, you'll have a totally different knot on your hands. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> For there. Let's give that knot another try, okay? All right, we got this. Okay. Okay. That's definitely she loves me, she loves me not. 
Yes. Okay. Yeah. She loves me. She loves me not. I'll give it a shot. Not so tough now, are you? Ha! It's working. Huh? Oh, excellent. I don't know what the fuck that is. Uh, flies wings. I think that's yeah. Pull off, pull the, off the flies wings. Yep. Pull off the flies wings. Like this? That helped a little. Okay. I don't know what the fuck that is. Pull the finger. Oh, good idea. Yeah, true. Pull the finger. Gotcha. Hey, that did something. I got it! Yes! Hey, get your mitts off that! What the heck? Avert your eyes! For there, get me a towel. Brother Lightbeard, what is all that stuff? I know it looks like a big hoarding junk pile, but you have to understand. It's a big hoarding I junk pile. I might need some of this stuff someday. <laughs> but everything you said about lightness, I... I don't know what I believe. You get a line and I'll get a pole, honey. You get a line and oh, I'll get a pole. Oh, this is bad. Hey, is that a heavy-duty anti-gravity thrust unit right there? I have no idea, but you're welcome to take it. What? No, that's mine. My likeness. As a matter of fact, is there any place you'd like it delivered? Perfect. Yep, this came from my ship. Someone must have looted it while I was asleep. You sure you don't want to ride over the plague dam with us, Father? No. I need to go take care of Harmony. Goodbye, space boys. <laughs> that was weird. Yeah. I mean, it's nice to look young, but I'm obviously a grown man, right? <laughs> I love how they do so many call-outs to like, Yeah! You guys thought they were the same person? Nice try. <laughs> it's not. Don't you That's feel not stupid? what it is. Your theories are stupid. <laughs> Real seagulls, not made of yarn. This poor, poor boy. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm a real boy. So we need to get this fish, and then we're gonna tell the lady, "Oh, we caught this fish with our with our crochet hook." Yeah. So we need to tell. So you take the. So it's a super good hook, right? And so we need to tell the tree a joke that's funny that makes him laugh. Okay. And it was fucking impossible. It took so long because there was no like anything discerning I just, logic about how about I what just you had should to say. Guess for thirty minutes. Oh my god. Tree. Human. Uh. That fish up there in your branches? Can I have it? Sorry, I caught it. Until it falls from my branches, it's mine. That's the code of the trees. Okay. The code of trees. Oh, come on. You don't need that fish. I happen to think it brings an interesting asymmetry to my look. So back off. <laughs> the tree's like, I just got a new asymmetrical cut, okay? Hey, want to hear a joke? Ooh, is it a tree joke? Uh. Say, do you know old Pete the pine tree? Piney Pete down the hill? Sure, good friend of mine. Uh. Well, I hear he got in some really big trouble. Oh no, what for? It seems he was being really naughty. Oh. Oh! <laughs> Naughty! <laughs> Smug. <laughs> you get a line and I'll get a pole. We'll go down to the crawdad hole. Yikes! How's that thing talking? Oh, that's creepy. See? Doing you a favor and getting rid of it. <laughs> okay, just stay quiet, you. Honey, sugar paw baby mine. Shh! <laughs> you get a lo lot of fish when you use the right equipment. 
You caught that fish? On this beach? What's your secret? Hmm. Maybe I'll show you sometime. Let me think about it. Ah. And then we give her the crochet hook. Okay, you've worn me down. I've decided to tell you about my fishing secret weapon. Your what? This. The hook that I caught that amazing fish with. I call it the fish reaper. Or freeper. You don't say. Hey, uh, do you suppose I could borrow your freeper for a little while? But please promise to leave some fish in the ocean for future generations. Thanks, kid. Guess I don't need this anymore. Come to Carol, my yeah. beauties. You just gotta throw what you don't want anymore, like, out. <laughs> you know, the, when you throw stuff out, you don't put it in the garbage, the planet doesn't have out, okay? It all just stays here. All right, it stays here. You know? It's just there. It's just there. Hey, there's a big sparking hole in the floor. That's your superconductive gyroscopic hypercam in action, man. Works like crazy. Well, look at that. Alright, we gotta use this on this. I can't wire that. Yes, you can. Looks like this little guy lost all his low-level wiring. That all explains right. why he's out cold. So, uh, if you my wiring helped. Let's say, okay, so you're gonna do oh, this. Uh, this end this here, isn't the actual answer, but I'm showing here. you an example of. There goes nothing. What you need to do. So let's say you do this, okay? And it's like this. Now I'm out of wire. Looks mostly right. And that's a charging no station. Huh. It's not exactly the same shape, but maybe if I turn it. I see. Ah. So you see those shapes? <laughs> those shapes are actually points on the hexapal for the different spots they go to. Yeah. So what you want to do now is look at the picture. Is is yeah. wait, let me explain. Sorry. You go to Vela's place. Any status change on Creepy Wolf? No. He's still monitoring. Shut up. Okay, so I look at the picture. This is a sweet picture. Yeah, it helps me remember. And, and you always a teenager. You write that down. And you figure out what points on the hexapal those shapes translate to. And you can do that by switching the... So right now I know where each wire is, so I know where each part of it is, so then you figure it out. But I'm just going to give you the answer now. So I'm going to pick this up. And... Okay, so cut these. It's gonna give you the answer. I have it written down. It is blue goes here. Okay. Connecting to this terminal. And then what is next? Red? Okay, that's yellow, so I wanna cut that. Yellow goes from this point there. That's what I meant. To this point. And then red goes from this Put point some wire here to this point. That's all my wire. So Let's this should this be path. the answer. Okay. Fuck! No, that was the answer for something else. Shit. Is this a different answer than the, what I had? What's going on? No, I'm out of wire. I think I, this is a different answer from what I had before, so it's different. Weird. So I think you have to chart it. Let's see if this works. I have a good feeling about that pattern. But I don't know why. Hey, he's alive. You're alive, little buddy. How do you feel? So glad to have you back. But regardless, that is how you do it. That's how you do it. And it might be different for everyone, actually. But 
Hey, how about this little guy? I think he wants to help. Wow, look at him go. That's cute! <laughs> oh, and he knows electronics. Great. He might just be the genius I was looking for. Yep, and they do windows. Well, I couldn't patch everything, but the main living areas should hold together now. Well then, that means this ship is ready to fly to Laruna. How about you guys? I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, here we go. Beepy boop bop bop. Stop. You aren't going anywhere. Who are you guys? Bella's family. We've been talking to people. And we've connected some dots. When Mob Chothra ate my sister, he barked you up. Please tell us where our daughter is. Oh, now She's... you care? She's gone beyond the plague damage. We're all going after her. Who's we? It sounds like all of us. Yeah, um, I had already initiated launch, but, um, nice to meet you guys. I'm a friend of your daughter's. I'm sorry, but I, like, I don't buy this mother being, like, all concerned about where she is now. You are ready for her to die. I know! Like, they were... Uh, makes, me, makes me pissed. Frustrated. Cause it's like suddenly you care now that people think that she's a big deal. The yeah. Jedi God has truly risen and exposed a whole new segment of beachfront property for development. Looks like this day turned out okay after all. The women in your in your village are have been killed so far as you know, and you think this day is okay. Fine. Yeah. You know what? Fine. You're just in time. Marikai is leaving the ship. Look, there he goes. Is everything else ready? I baked the cake, put it in the oven. Great, <laughs> and let's get out of here. <laughs> Thank you for getting my baking reference. She didn't get it, she just wanted you to shut up. I know, she's <laughs> like, right, okay, well. My friend engaged. See you later. Later, I loser. alive. I'm alive. I'm uninhibited. I'm beautiful. It's alive? Everything's in here. She went out in glory. Holy smokes. I can't believe that worked. I can. Believe in yourself, Vela. So I wonder how those eyes work since they're not really eyes. They are eyes because they're they're monitors. Remember, it goes into that one place. Yeah. Remember, all the eyes go to one central monitor. You mean the ones that America was looking at? Yeah. Something tells me we've arrived. Wow. So, what do we do now? Honk or something? Time to see if the ship's communication system still works. Hello. Uh, ahoy. This, this is the star uh, airship Malaruna requesting re-entry. Um... I've been gone a long time, but if you could just open the door, we'll come in and explain. Alex, I don't think that's going to... Oh, never mind. Look at that. Yes. Oh, wait a second. What's that? Dad, is that? That's our ship. You think Mom's on board? Brace yourself. You hit them. Hey, we're on autopilot. But look, since we're so close, I'll extend our gangway and you can use it to go say hi. It's way too short. What, you're afraid of a little jump? They're firing at her! Quick, back up! Let them get out of range! I told you, autopilot. Well, do something! Okay, everybody be quiet. I need to think. 